Okay. Back to you. Mm -hmm. I'll be back. Last time the 144 didn't come back. We gotta get it together if we're gonna do live. I, I always just go, I'm doing live right now. Never plan it. Never plan for it properly. Let's see how this camera goes. Yeah, 14. Yeah, at least there's more coming through on it. Yeah. It seems like when you get calls, it just goes. It's back. over. Well, I went back there, I had to get a code. Yeah, I know. It was black the whole time after that. What was that? It's going dry so fast. Yep. It's not a half, not dead, but it was half. <laughs> Great to be back. <laughs> Sorry, man. I cut you guys off like it just did it on its own. We changed cameras, though. We changed uh, cockapoo. Thanks, Tracy. Appreciate you. My package? What package? Shitsu shouldn't shed. Jax has not gone home yet. Uh, Dad hasn't picked up. He's quiet though, isn't he? He's not in there waiting. Leave in conditioner. But her parent is here, so I'm moving pretty quickly. Dad, people are asking on the live feed if uh, the you guys went in for the surgery, but did they? Are you on anything for the ear infection? Did they m mention anything? What is it, uh, Did they give you like a medicine for the ears though? Yeah, we're on it all the time. Okay, okay. Zymox? Yeah. For the ears? Okay. The one without the uh, steroids. So Dad's telling us you know, what, what the ears are. They do look better from last time, but looking in them, they still look very inflamed. It's a reoccurring thing. Right. Now that maliceitic otic, 
I've helped a lot of cocker spaniels with it, and if you do that, it doesn't it doesn't recur. You just but you do have to do it forever, you know. Right. And you get to a point where you just do it once a month. Yeah, the mouse and just, and herd don't do very well. No. no. What does it do? She doesn't know it's good in there. Oh. Oh. Your dog's sleeping while I work? This is not fair, man. <laughs> this is not fair. I don't know what's going on, but. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Got a mole in there. You had that mole removed, but it wasn't cancerous or anything, right? No. Did they check for it? Did they yeah. check it? They checked it. Yeah. It was benign then? Yep. Okay, good. Now, as your dog gets older, like uh, my dog, he had about 50 of them, so. Uh, she has them all over. Yeah, yeah. It was, that one was the one that was bothering us. Oh, what do you mean? She's licking and chewing at it? That mole, right, there was a mole right there. Kind of, or it was the biggest one out of all of them. Mm -hmm. But what would she do that when you say it was bothering her? What was she doing? She just lick it. Lick it, chew it, irritate it, right? Yeah. Okay. And uh, like a permanent hot spot. Yeah, she has them all over, which is very common in like the cocker spaniel. She's cockapoo, correct? Yeah. 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 Exactly. Or, yeah. Mhm. Mm and uh, it's like right her, in there. I see it. We had her teeth cleaned and washed them under. They were it. Everywhere. Oh, yeah, yeah, had a teeth clean. Perfect opportunity to do that then. Oh, yeah. Do you remember what the additional charge was to remove that on top of uh, the dental? Is it like 50 bucks extra, or was it really like 100 and something bucks extra? Do you know? I don't know yeah. what the separate cost Sure, sure. What was the dental charge? Uh, let's see, total bill was five something. 500 or something? That's not bad. That's not too bad. I've had um, clients tell me 1,000. Thousand fifteen hundred. 1500 so depending on where you go, you know? Yeah, I go up to uh, Chisholm Ridge. Chisholm Ridge. I've heard really good things about Chisholm Ridge. Oh, yeah. Very conservative. Mm-hmm. Um, tries to least expensive. Yep, parts, yep. And then move and stop as needed. That's good to know. That, would, that You're probably the third or fourth. There's a few clients, but not everyone tells me their experiences. Sometimes I don't have time to ask. But for the most part, Chisholm Ridge is uh, one of the top three that I refer to. So it's good to know. Take her, all three of our dogs up there, so. Cool. And first name, so. Really? Oh, yeah. I have a problem with that. <laughs> I have a problem with first names, man, so that's awesome. Yeah. So, they know us well in there. That's great. I don't know what I'm doing here. i got to change out my brush here. Almost done, about four minutes. We want to make sure we touch everything in the face here. It's kind of wet. She didn't love the blow dry session, so we don't push it. This can air dry just fine, you know what I mean? Make sure I get all those. If there's any knots at all, I want to get them out of there. Don't let me forget to do the nails. Didn't do that one yet. You'll hear the knot. You're like click, 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 and then now it's smooth, nice and smooth.
You gotta get every hair through the comb here. Brush, through the brush. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Make sure you that mat out, remember, so that's all nice and clean now. Jackie's dad. Is that Jackson's dad? Yes. Hey, hey, he did great. He did? He did. That's good. We got him on live feed this morning, so we'll tell the wife, you know, check it out on our channel. Oh, I'm sorry, say again? On live feed on our YouTube channel. Okay. So we kind of groomed him live. She can have fun watching it. Just type in my favorite groomer on uh, YouTube. All right, we'll do it. Yeah, he did great. He's right, come a great. long way, man. Uh, <laughs> maybe he's getting mellow in his own. Is he mood. falling in love with me finally? Yeah, no. That's it, that's it. <laughs> I'm just playing. Who's that? Didn't even know he was here, did ya? Say bye, Jax. Bye. See you later. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thank you. See you next time. Don't I know dad's out there, but <laughs> what a dork. <laughs> she said, What a dork I am. I don't even know what they're talking about, man. Boop, 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 boop. You see here. Remember all that stuff? Get it out of the mouth. Yeah, there's a lot there, isn't there? You got a lot of stuff in your mouth. So it just rock the teeth out, man. Let me see. Look right here, girlfriend. Yes, look right here. Say we're done? Say we're done now? Are we done? Okay, I'll do the nails. Can you stay there for me? Can you stay there for me? Yeah. Oh, I, there's not a lot to take off, is there? There's not a lot to take off.
Lexi is a little bit of a weight, and then I have a regular Shih Tzu. But you guys will probably have to wait. I think it's a, uh, depends on the time. I think she's at 1230 Texas time, so. I, gotta, I don't know what time it is right now. I need to get that clock I'm talking about so you guys can really watch how long the process really takes. You know what I mean? Yes, bring, bring your dog or book a traveling groom. Traveling groom start at $350. Good girl, come on, you're all right. You're all right. Do they do the nails at the veterinarian too? Yeah. Yeah, that's why they're so short. I'm like, there's not a lot for me to take off, but Maybe you guys had them done. It makes sense. They got them short. Yeah. They might have went in the vein, which is the best time to do a trim like that while she's under. All right, you guys. I'll be right back with you. I'll let her let him go home. I'm just going to check some stuff real fast. Did you just lick my fingers? You know this is your harness here? Mm -hmm. Put your foot in there. Put your foot in there. You did so good. You did so good. Yes, you did. You did so good. Okay. All right. Let's go here. Come down. here we go she did great she did great man only had one knot in the back and now in the back of her ear now no big deal cool. so good job and I can't believe it's been like oh a little over three months and no mats so that's awesome oh, yeah. really awesome say bye see you later say bye good to go you guys all paid out and everything right yep okay so give cool. me a hug thank all you right. so much appreciate y'all yep we'll see you next time yeah you have a good one bye Man, I am hungry, you guys. Does the dog need to be completely dry after a bath to use the clippers? Nah, not really. Let me see if I can twist you guys around here. Hold on, bear with me here. Thanks, you guys. So 68 of you out of 144 actually, uh, oh, looks at, what's that? I've got, I don't know what that is over there on the screen. Okay, so 68 of you, 69 are here. <laughs> What a clean shop. I know, I, I, I tried, I, and I'm not perfect. Can you imagine? Oh gosh, you guys have no idea. We've walked, I have walked into some shops and I'm like, whoa, smoking on the job, every, like I've seen it all. And a lady was grooming a dog. I went in to sell groomer supply, right? And I, a lady was grooming a dog with a cigarette, ashtray on the table, dogs on the table. I was like, oh my, a poodle strapped with a chain, like a chain chain around a what an old metal teacher's desk and i kind of looked in and i was like hey i'm just here kind of give you my flyer and i was like oh my gosh i left i had smoke on my face i was like wow that's that's all i gotta say uh and i was like wow that's what's that's what i'm competing against against <laughs> so i'm pretty clean for a groomer i really think i'm really clean i'm not being conceited i'm just saying i'm pretty picky if I could even have, if I had more time, can you imagine how much cleaner I would be? Holy cow. So if I, I don't, is it illegal? I don't know that it's illegal, man. If I, uh, 
if I had more, I want to, when I can afford it, you guys don't know how expensive it is, but if I can afford it, I just want one person. All they do is clean. That's all they do. They walk around, clean, dust, everything. I wish I could have that. Uh, one day I will. I think one day I will, or we'll be so mobile by that time that, well, I don't know, man. You never know what's going to happen. Please stay alive. <laughs> I'm like, I'm out of here. <laughs> um, okay. So it's 1130. You guys have me for a little while here. I guess David, this is taking up my whole time but day with these folks, man. Do you like it? Do you guys like it, man? People are just coming and going like a channel, you know? She needs easy. to eat. I can eat um, I can eat and talk. Makes your job easy. Yeah. He doesn't have to do any videos today when that happens. Oh, good job, babe. Hair. Look at your hair, man. What's it doing? I've been working too hard over <laughs> here. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I am hungry, but... Oh, yeah, I brought some bread and some roast beef. Oh, yeah. Nah, I'm good. Hey, Kim. Hey. Kim Marquis, I got your uh, invite to your baby shower. <laughs> I was going to talk about it later on. Uh, Holland, let me go back here. Yeah, I love my David. We argue a lot, though, on Not camera. Not really. Not really. <laughs> okay, so people are like, is that your son? Oh, yes, he's my son. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking hilarious. Oh, that's <laughs> sick, man. That's sick. <laughs> I'm kidding. Oh, uh, from Holland. I don't have a dog, but I, thank you. Thanks for watching, man. Hmm. My cousin's shop is as clean as yours. Awesome. Brought Lilo to her once for nail clipping. Didn't do it again because Lilo was too stressed and hissy. Yeah, you got to pay someone to come to your house for that. What's up, Kim? Yippee. Yeah, I love Kim. Uh, lo I love your interaction. Interaction with who? You, the dogs, or David? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sending Faith in Saki accessories. Oh, you are? Cool. You know, I haven't released uh, Donnie. If you guys saw Donnie, I haven't released him. David's like, you can't keep him. And now his name's Brownie. <laughs> we changed his name. <laughs> <laughs> Took us like four days to change his name. We were calling him Bonnie, Donnie, Honey. He actually pays more attention Downey. to Brownie, though. Yeah, he loves the the name Brownie. So we'll watch, watch him. He'll be coming up more. Vermont, what's up? Okay, I'm now kind of caught up. Now, is the person who was asking about nicking a dog still out there? It's awesome that you and David can work together. Oh, you have, Tracy, you have no <laughs> idea, man. Ooh, we have some full-on blow-up. He's so, nah. he's, I don't know he's not he's going to tell you the about. truth. He's not going to, I'm truthful, okay? He is not that truthful. I am so truthful. Did you do this, David? No. <laughs> and we know he did, you know what I'm talking about? Really? I just love you. <laughs> Cats and cat dog, cat dog. <laughs> yes, yeah, sex cures it. Does it? No, it doesn't, man. Sex <laughs> doesn't cure that whole like. Are you kidding me? <laughs> uh, but good comment, Haley. I appreciate you thinking about the sex side of things. Lila loves you, and David, she's my window listening now. Cool. I really okay. So we uh, we received some compilation stuff. I went back and looked at some comp some people who sent me videos and stuff like that. <laughs> Mischievous face. Yes. Um, Mm-hmm. What's that mean? Mischievous means something behind it, like... Ah. Uh, mm. mm. His first language is uh, Spanish, so some things he's not going to understand right away. Zen master. Zen master at work only. And with animals only, not humans. Zen, you know what that is? To be like peaceful and mm, like zen. zen, like the zen sign, the peace sign. Yeah, well, sort of like yeah. zen being you work with da the David the dog, <laughs> Sammy Davis. You know, you work. He's like, yeah, mm. I know. Yeah. You can do that with the dog, but he can't do that with humans. Okay, uh, Chili, really, Chili's in the house. I've seen your videos when you fight over responding faster and paying attention to the road. <laughs> <laughs> right, like. <laughs> Sammy Davis loves David, but I want to, if, if the, Gretchen, come get back to me. If that was Sammy Davis's last groom, then I have a, uh, have a different mentality on it. What if Sam, first groom? no, Sammy Davis's last groom was really great with David there, but I feel like if the last two grooms have been really good. Yeah. Yeah. The last two grooms, but the last one, Sammy Davis seemed like I told David, like I told David and God, I was like, God, if this might be our last groom, so 
I freaked out at David for holding him without a cone. It's very dangerous. I'm not willing to sacrifice anybody to a bite. Um, I'm like that too, David, only with animals. Yeah, exactly. So pe me and David will bicker fight worse than David would ever bicker fight with an animal. So five months, let's move on. Do you still work with Romeo? Romeo hasn't come in. Um, they never tried to come back in after I said, look, if you can't come in once a month, I can't keep doing this. And, and I said, I decided on uh, Romeo. I said, if you can't come in once a month, this is your rate. It was like 130 plus tax. So if you can't come in once a month, it's 130 plus tax. If you come in once a month, it's 100 plus tax. Because what you keep doing is bringing him in matted. If he comes in not matted, then we can talk, right? A bird. I've been asked, a groom, I've never heard of grooming a bird in the sense of, I've had calls, people asking me to do bird nails. I've never done it. And I, Bye, David. And then I've never... Uh, let's go wash our hands. What happened to your hand? I'm not... Tracy, that's exactly my point. I, I can't tell you everything, but I um, can't tell you about my hand. All I can say was from the road, from a road, from pavement. Okay, um, let me wash my hands. Gosh darn it, I saw you dance bachata. I know, man. I know how to dance bachata. We got to get David in for classes. I was talking about something, I forgot. I grew up birds, yeah. So, uh, nails, beaks, conditioning, feathers, really? I'm kind of, okay, David's mom and Cynthia, you guys remember Cynthia? We actually moved Cynthia's birds to David's mom's house. And birds are uh, different. They're a different kind of animal. That one did not uh, make it. Because when you tra traumatize the world of a bird, they kind of stress out too much. David said their hearts are too small, they can't handle certain things. So, I want to say... I probably wouldn't, I don't know, I'm, I, you should see me and my sister when she had ferrets. I'd be jumping on the couch, I'd be like, ah, I would not want to get touched by the ferret. So it's kind of funny that you say, you know, have you done a bird and stuff. I've done lizard nails, rabbit nails, pig nails. I have not done bird nails. I would if the pet parent could hold the bird. And I have, I bet you probably have to sharpen the beak. I bet there is some things you do with the bird, but I haven't, I haven't done that. So, Of course she sees a message that's not my question, oh well. Uh, repeat it. To groom a lab, what would you do? A dog that walks, sheds a lot, use a firm. Okay, so that's such a huge question. So there's a video on that. Go to my website, my favorite, or youtube.com slash my favorite groomer in Dee Dee Croy's channel. Type in Husky and type in, what's the other breed that I do a lot of? Husky and German Shepherd. I just sent a whole bunch of links out to a person asking the same question. It's just too endless. You need six products on that it's under myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop in the kit section it says large grooming kit it's everything you need to do if you follow one of those videos along we sand the beak okay i heard of that can't even do my baby's nails still really your son should hold the dog while you do the nails and just take two little slivers off each nail until you feel comfortable Oh yeah, so if you want a, um, oh here, let me go back. Uh, have you ever seen a fluff, a husky that wasn't fluffy? I don't think huskies are fluffy, man. Those are not, huff it's flat hair, but it needs to be de-shedded. So on your uh, German Shepherd's paws, order this from me, paw balm, apply it every day. Or even this one, healing cream, tea tree aloe healing cream, okay? Where are you in Texas, Fort Worth, Texas? I'm getting a German Shepherd puppy in a few days, and your videos have given me so many thanks. I appreciate that, man. Those German Shepherd videos are serious. See, the same thing with the Huskies. Nose balm. So this is for hot spots. Um, I'm reading to see if this is for noses. Do you need a nose balm? Top knot gel, salmon oil. Nice and organized. I know, right? You name it, I'm going to talk to you about it. Hot spot foam. All this is on our... I don't plan the lives very well. Um, natural bandage. So here's some options for the people who are nicking. You can do some of these minor things, but it depends on how bad the nick is, okay? And be honest. Be honest about it or we can't answer the question can do this good nutrition supports immune health this is for 
uh, consumption. Grease out shampoo. I'd have to get back with you on the nose situation, but if you're interested, I will get it for you. Nose balm. I think I've heard of it. The nose is such a... I know what you're talking about. I don't know why I wouldn't put, apply this paw balm on there. Spontaneous dreams are the best. Are they? I think they are if, if folks are able to get on board, right? So the paw balm, I'll have to do some more research. Uh, I want to say I would apply this to the dog's nose. It says restores moisture and softens, reduces slippage, conditions and protects. So, and it's natural. And the ingredients in it are lanolin, beeswax, carnauba wax, sweet almond oil, aloe oil, lemon peel oil, vitamin E, comfrey extract, and arnica. So I would read, I would feel comfortable, but I would want, I would call the company and I will, I will call the company and double check and make sure and do a little extra reading. And then I'll put that on the notes section of that. Okay, I'm gonna move on from that question. Uh, try, uh, Ty wants to know how the 19 year old dog, how the 19 year old dog is doing. The 19 year old dog, Coconut? Yeah. She's just amazing, man. Let me see here. I don't think she was 19. I thought she was older than that, you guys. Uh, Yvonne's texting me. She she said, um, I'm thinking about you. It's funny. I was on live the whole time. I said, did you catch my live? I'm uh, responding to a nail trim. They want to do a walk-in. So I was actually going to, hmm, let me see if I have coconut. I was actually going to call Coconut's mom, but let me go. Let me just talk to focus on you guys. I think she's doing great. I was going to say, hey, how's Coconut doing? Okay. Um, my dog has black nails. We're very long. We adopted now. I watch your videos. I've gotten them way done short. Thank you so much. Really awesome. Would coconut oil be good for the nose? I would do a little extra reading, but why not? Uh, I would try it. You just don't want, the nose is like 3,000 times more sensitive than our noses. So you want to be really careful what you put on there. If the nose is extremely dry, say yes or no is it extremely dry and crusty and flaking off yes little coconut hey dd for an aussie doodle do you recommend grooming once a month along with daily brushing daily brushing with a comb with a brush daily it must be done properly and once a month grooming i told this lady who recently brought in a golden doodle look i said you need to come in once a month I'm hanging that up. Yes, once a month uh, to, with a professional, someone that knows what they're doing. Okay. Until if, if they can avoid that every two months, uh, great. If not, every month. So when you are going to buy a $2,500, $1,500, $1,600, $5,000 dog, I suggest that you book at the same time all your groomings for the year. That's just that's my opinion. Okay, so maybe we'll go back up. I know a company that that makes nose, paw, and skin balm, if you are interested in knowing. Email it over. Wow, crazy. Yeah, I know. I have to go now. See you later. Huh? Hey, you guys, please share the video. Share a video right now before you, when we log off, David wants you to share a video to help us get to 100,000. We just reached our 70,000 mark. It is unreal to me. That, that hair over there is unreal. Just wait till that video comes out. Uh, oh my God, that's horrible. It is horrible. My neighbor was a golden dude. I, I'm not judging. I'm just saying like, wow, like, wow. It was a lot of hard work. Like, we don't need to be there, you know, because we, we had the briefing once before. If I didn't give you a briefing, I get it. But if I've ever briefed you and told you what to do and how to do it and showed you a video, then we should be in a different place. Wouldn't you guys agree? you never seen a dog's ears go black. I don't know what that means. Yeah, I thought she was older than 19. Okay, so I'm, I'm kind of caught up here. 
I asked once but forgot, have you groomed an Afghan hound? Yeah, one time, a long time ago. It wasn't uh, a time I was on video, though. Interested cirrhosis pugs need nose balm. You're interested, Mikio? On oh, my, I've got, I have to go wash my hands from dealing with that, that thing. Let me see here. Amazing that you got it off in the one piece. I really tried to get it off on the one piece to show how important it is to really pay attention to what the heck you're doing at home, and then to also show that. You, when you have it help the, the hair pulling, it allows you to see where the skin actually is connected. So you can actually chisel, chisel, pull, chisel, chisel, pull, chisel, chisel. There's something that I do when you do that. You pull it back, chisel, pull it back, chisel. So it really helps too. That's pretty cool about the about that. Yeah, if you need paw balm, let me know. I have it. If you need nose balm, let me know. I'll, I'm pretty sure that one you can put on there. I'm going to wash my hands again. Okay, let's see where you guys are at. The next client is in about 40 minutes. So I'm going to let you guys go in about 5 minutes here, I think. I don't know, unless you guys want to stay on. I guess I can let it stream. We've got this new phone that I don't have to pay attention. Uh, where am I from? I'm from all over. You have to watch the very first video on the screen. It's the introduction video. It kind of tells you a little bit about me. I don't do cats very often, but I do have a matted cat coming in. Is that for me? Yeah. Ooh, David made me a sandwich. <laughs> How do you know I'm hungry, man? Me and my dog enjoy Hershey's chocolate. I thought chocolate's bad for dogs. I mean... The milk chocolate won't kill your dog as fast as dark chocolate will, though. Can you kill your... Hmm? Do you know? My next client is Shih Tzu. Hmm. <laughs> I'm scrolling back. What are you guys all doing, man? 107 of you now? That's awesome. Yeah, Ciro's, uh email me. I'll check it out. I can't guarantee I'll bring it on, but... As a company, uh, there are minimum orders for each, each uh, company you order from. Sometimes a minimum order is five thousand dollars, so it's really tough to make it uh, make it in this world of online shopping, right? Why does my dog's hair clump up so much? Depends on the breed. I'm not really sure what you mean. So the lady who asked about the nicking is not there anymore. Mikio, you're still in bed. You're at California time. What's it like? Twelve o'clock. Let me see here. Twelve o'clock there. About to go college shopping. Cool. Cooking dinner? Mmm, what are you cooking? Cooking dinner and watching video? I could not do that, man. Mm -hmm. You told him. I don't, I forgot what that's about. I'm doing nothing but to go Pokemon Go. Pokemon? They still do that? Watching me. I'm sorry. You want to look at the um, screen or something while I'm eating? Yeah, I'm making a DVD video. Kim knows. Everybody knows. I have emails on people. I need to get that done. Northern California. Um, Yvonne Reyes. And there's another lady. She's very confidential. She might be willing to take you on. Depends on what kind of dog you have. Yes, Allie. I have a couple. You have to email me. Why does your mom keep feeding the dog chocolate? Get the chocolate out of the house. Who does that? Weird. That's scary. So you're going to the beach tomorrow? Nice. Watching ID over here. I'm just eating cereal. Mmm. Almost 10 in Cali. Oh, okay. Place the matted hair in a frame under glass before hanging. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I gotta go get a frame now. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna sell that baby. <laughs> I just did a cockapoo. Did you not, did you see him? Her? I saw her. Brush every day on a table. If you need a table and arm, that's the best way to do it. So you're controlling the situation. Getting the dog used to stay, brush, do the face, you know, that. Lamb roast. Nice. 10 o'clock in Cali. What's up, well, Cali? There's a lot of Cali's out there. About to bring my dog to the vet. 
I asked about your routine with accidental nicks. Oh, okay. So, um, it's been a long time since I nicked a dog, but can it happen? Yes. What are you going to do? Immediate reaction is like, oh, shit. <laughs> if the pet parent's standing right there, you just immediately recognize it. Oh, I nicked your dog. So sorry. Get the peroxide clean. Depends on, this is a minor nick, like minor. And then I'm going to do a nick video later. Peroxide or alcohol, whatever you can get your hands on to clean that wound area, depending on how bad it is, you're going to apply pressure just like you would if I cut, like I, I cut my whole pinky off. I cut the whole thing off. It was like a Pac-Man. And because it slipped on a carrot, on a dull knife. Immediate reaction was stop, apply, pre clean it. I was like pouring alcohol on it. Apply pressure, hold it, stop the bleeding. My finger was almost hanging off. I mean, it, and I did not go to the hospital. I did not have insurance. So I was like, I don't have insurance. I don't know what to do. I'm going to fix it myself. So I cleaned it with alcohol. I got a cup of ice water. Do you feel me? You got to think like yourself. So if the nick's not that bad, alcohol, clean it, apply pressure. If it's bleeding, if it's not bleeding, move on, cleaned it, move on. And then you want to let it air. You don't want it to be an open wound. If it's bleeding big time, that's a whole different situation. Okay. Are we, did we tell that? Oh, dad already went home. Okay. So no one's here. I think I answered that. Hmm. I was like, is that dog still here? Nothing's on my sandwich except for me, and it's plain. No, I didn't. There's, I think there's some here. No, I love mayonnaise. It's weird. <laughs> Dry sandwich. Dry. <laughs> I actually only need one piece of bread with this amount of meat in there. Germany, what's up? Enjoy my sandwich. Thanks, I've got a new do going on, man. It's pretty cool. Took a minute to get it. I was very upset with the first haircut, and I went back, they fixed it. Oh, there's some ketchup. You want half? No, I already ate. What? what? Aspiring to be a groomer from Canada, man. I just love Canada. I'm just, I'm wondering where I'm supposed to, how am I supposed to see everybody? I want to see everybody. How do I make that happen, you know? So we've been talking about going mobile grooming across the nation, but how do I make that happen without losing so much money, losing so much time, you know? What do you guys think? Okay, let me go here. Lab Australian Shepherd. This is pretty huge. Mmm, sorry. The one on the floor, the worst in 10 years. The the worst I've ever had to do on a dog on matting was a, when I worked at a veterinarian, had to be sedated. Like there was just, it was so painful. The dog was in so much pain. Is it? I need no more meat, man. I love roast beef. I don't eat it very often. You know, if you, I think 50% of you guys don't own pets and are not in the grooming industry. You just watch and watch me work, and it's soothing and enjoyable, right? I've heard that a lot. Let's have get in, Dee Dee. Get in, Dee Dee. Have a reunion? We never even had a beginning meeting. <laughs> How many of you that don't? No, don't need groomer training and don't need grooming and don't need all that right how many of you don't need any of that would actually pay to go to like a what are those called not a convention but a a group how, how many of you guys would pay and actually fly out and be like we're going to meet dd yeah meet and greet how many would you pay to make that happen then you get to socialize with people that you met on youtube all these years So that cat, would you actually come out to a seminar? It's not a seminar. It's called something else. But something like that. Would you guys pay? Invest. Not me. Not necessarily me. But like there's an entry fee. So the first day is like meet and greet. We have breakfast. We do seminars. You don't have to learn. You don't have to go to the seminars. But you can go to the meet and greet. Come out. Go to the meet and greet. 
take your break, you know, you're staying in a hotel or an Airbnb or something like that. I do my seminars with clients who are uh, for YouTube, you know what I mean? You have your seminars, and then you have like that night, you have a dinner together, right? So there's things that you guys would do because you're now going to be around that person that you support, you know? Would you guys actually go? And that's just a hundred of you. How much notice do you need? Hmm? You guys would all do that, really? I'm being serious, man. Don't mess with my feelings over here. <laughs> you guys have to actually buy a ticket. You guys have to actually buy a hotel. You actually have to plan around your work. Is it worth it? Yeah, I've been to Jersey quite a few times. My sister was stationed there. Look up Bob Ross. She says, you're the Bob Ross of pet grooming. You come in your RV. You swear, Mikio, you would drive your RV. I mean, I'm telling you. Are you serious? See, people are being honest. Sorry, they, they wouldn't go. Of course it's worth it. Uh, I swear. <laughs> she sweared. Mikio would actually come out. So, okay, next question. How much... Uh, Station in Cali, come here. Woo, 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 woo. How much time do you need? Three months? You need three months to plan. What if I did this and no one showed up? I mean, I would be so hurt. I would be like, wow, we did all this planning and no one showed up. A painting artist? They said um, they need a few months. Bob Ross, the painting that has a soothing voice. Uh, oh, yeah, I know who it is. Is it the guy that with the yeah. fluffy... Yes, yes. I used to watch him, man, every, what, day after school? And you do the trees like this. <laughs> I used to watch him. I think with the afro kind of thing? Yes, so. Yeah, yeah. She's like, yeah, that's him. <laughs> I didn't know his name, but I watched him since I was probably eight years old. You know what I'm saying? Like, I watched him too. Yeah, David's my husband. Are you my husband, a boyfriend, or, I mean, sex partner? I mean, what are you? Bather? Son? <laughs> I'm just playing around, man. Happy little mistake. Yes, that's him. Happy little trees. Happy little trees, yeah! Happy little mistake. <laughs> yeah, man. Okay. I'll work on something for you guys. Yeah, it's been a while, right? When's the last time you saw me? Would there be an age restriction? How old are you, Georgia? It's not an age restriction. What are we doing here, man? This is not like that. Can you bring your dog? Now I gotta get the... It's gotta be a establishment that allows all that, right? It's my birthday. You're 13. What? Cool! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you. 13 years old, man. What was I doing? I was 13, man. You don't even want to know. <laughs> really, those of us that, that, those of us that have no idea, excuse me, those of us that have no need to watch you and watch you anyway, solely because we enjoy you. Wow, really? That's awesome. That touches my heart. Thank you so much. Yeah, you exactly. Uh, Mikio is like, it has to allow animals because I'm always with an animal. Believe it or not, I went to, where did we go? Where did we go that Pasadena, California, the Groom Expo West allowed no pets? It was all carpet, that's why. There was pets there. There was pets there being groomed, pets in competition grooming, but you could not bring your own pet in there. Do you guys not remember that? You're 50 years old and she just groomed her dog the very first time. That is freaking awesome, man. Straight up, that's me. Just love watching. I'm a pet parent, though. Straight up. Monique! <laughs> watching from the UK. I love your vlogs. I have a Westie and a Shih Tzu. Yeah. I really appreciate you guys, man. I would say that word, man. I, the senior disability dogs, I, I just don't know. I'm honored to groom them. Sometimes it's hard. Sometimes it's hard to watch. Thanks, Tracy. Make sure you share. Make sure you share. I want to help as many people as I can. I'm, I'm all looking outside and stuff as I talk to you guys. Like, 
So Jammin, would you show up at this uh, seminar? Yeah, I'm really honest, right? You actually can't even get on base, you guys. You can't get on base without uh, someone there accepting you. I could probably talk to, I could probably do something. I could probably make some calls and use my sister and have her help me make some calls. But even though I was in the military, I didn't retire. So, bye, Rachel. That's awesome, man. Please be, be sure to share. You know what I feel? Okay, let me go up. Bonita Tienda. How to get rid of hair splinters without tweezers on yourself? I had a, if you're the one that told me this three years ago, Dee Dee, use tape. Please say it all the time because it's, I got that from someone else. They're like, Dee Dee, just get masking tape. And so if you got a splinter here, you know, that's why I have this tape. Let me show you. Oh, yeah, here, the tough stuff too, gorilla tape. This gorilla tape. And it's empty, isn't it? Um, have some tape there. Strong ass tape. And one time I couldn't even get it. I just left the tape on there and let it like really sink in while I kept grooming. And then I pulled it off fast. So maybe that'll help you. I'm a pet parent to two dogs. Bye, Rachel. We have a mobile groomer here that comes on base. Really? Um, how, did she get like, find out a little bit more on that for me. I don't have any uh, base calls to go on base here at Carswell. I want to say there's not even housing on Carswell. Carswell is a Joint Reserve Air Station. Joint Reserve Navy Air Station. By age restrictions, some events would say that under 14 would have to be accompanied by someone over 18 to 21. So, Georgia, are you under 14? Okay. I love the window decorations. Me too, man. I did them. I did this all by myself. I use duct tape, exactly. Here, I'm gonna flip over. Look at this artwork I did. When I first moved in, it took hours, but remember I told you guys about the butterflies? So the dogs, when all my dogs left, the, the butterflies visited me. I mean, literally, swarming. I have pictures of butterflies. I'm gonna do a compilation on them. So all this is hand painted. It's like stamped on there with great paint and each one is individually put up there. They're all butterflies and it's a paw print. So from the outside of the window, you see the sticker, the paw print sticker that's in video one live today because we did a walkthrough. And then we did, I did the paint here. And then up there, that's on a Pinterest. I just chose a different set of colors on the fabric, cut each strand of fabric separately and then tied them in those chains and then those are looped up like that. Isn't that awesome? So you can get a lot of sunlight. Right? Isn't that awesome? Are you still working with schnauzers? Of course. Yeah, ask more, Ali. Okay. So pretty. Very creative. L love it. Yeah, me too. I loved it too. Oh, it was fun. It was fun to put together and stuff. There's 109 of you. I guess we're kind of just waiting out the Shih Tzu, right? Are we waiting out the Shih Tzu together? It's about to be here? Yeah. I better go make sure my table's clean then. Oh yeah, it's like 10 minutes in, in 10 minutes-ish. Yes, Gretchen's like, yes we are. We're waiting up, waiting on the Shih Tzu. She is a cutie too, you guys. Mm -hmm. You guys have seen her before and it's not very often. Livy, where are you going to grooming school? Do not do an, uh, my opinion, do not do an online school. Okay, Georgia, the thing is, is that if I was 13, I would have an adult with me. Are you, you know, who's, who's watching these? If they get picked up from traffic, trafficking, I'm going to be pissed. You feel me? Oh, Georgia's from the UK, so you would be coming from the UK. Let's just say you flew down to Texas, okay? Are you bringing the 13-year-olds with you? I don't have an age. I wouldn't personally say you have to be an age, but I would not want you to travel by yourself. You need a buddy system. You make me worry. I'm not bored. I'm just wondering if you're bored. I'm not doing anything right now. I don't know how to go slow. <laughs> Bye, Allie. On my way to 100 subs. Woo, thanks, Faith. Yep, go post some for me. 
if you guys watch 100, 104 of you, if you just shared it five times today, what, what could that potentially do? A lot. Mini poodle. Brush every day. Check with a comb. How old is the mini poodle, Patsy? Oh, Rachel, I've answered that question before. This is so dry, you guys. Can't even like eat fast. Okay, I better clean my table while we're talking. Okay, hold on. It's already time to clean, but I just want to make sure. Well, I can't see the battery. If I wasn't a groomer, okay, there's a bunch of other things that I feel like it's so stressful running a business. 49%. We have to bring a cable with an extension cord. Yeah. I have an extension cord here. I just got to see whether they might all be at home. I like to keep things organized, so it, may, it might be all at home. Okay. I love Hawaii. So when I go to Hawaii, I, I'm addicted to 7-Eleven, all the mm. Japanese food there. <laughs> David said we have an extension cord. <laughs> you do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's <geez>, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's like, look at this one. <laughs> Bye, you guys. Those that have to leave. Bye. See you later. Well, thanks for joining us. <laughs> He's freaking hilarious. Why are you not sweating with that rubber thing on, man? I would totally be sweating with that apron on. I would I'm be ready sweating. To go. I don't want to waste time. And... <laughs> <laughs> that extension cord's a hundred foot, like fifty foot long. Like what? I was like, yeah, we do need an extension cord, but I mean, if we had to, we do have one, right? <laughs> the murder apron. I know, right? Uh, murder. Oh wow. Did you guys see when I was dressed up like that a long time ago? It's like five years ago or more. And I was like, they called me Dexter. Uh, like, I don't watch Dexter, but it was funny. I was like, what? Oh, yeah, Dexter. I watched all the people. They were like, Didi, you look like Dexter. I would take off my mask, my glasses, my apron, my smock. <sighs> Anyways. Um, <laughs> Sydney, that's pretty cool. So what I would do, I would be working with no cell phone. I would not own a cell phone. I would uh, probably not own a computer unless I felt like, you know, I want to surf and stuff. I, I don't want to pay for cable, so I don't pay for cable. I, we, If we watch anything, we watch it online. So I would take that mentality, very earth-friendly, very clean, very uh, good person, uh, cl uh, what is it, work hard but play hard, and I would just want to have a more relaxing lifestyle, which means I don't want to be connected to Facebook. I don't want to be connected to anything. I want to be able to get up, Go to work, clock in, clock out, have an easy job, no stress. It doesn't matter how much money I make. And I would like to go to the beach after, every day afterwards and watch the sunset. And I would be doing that. I would work at a 7-Eleven. <laughs> I would work at a 7-Eleven in Hawaii. That's kind of in my head, right? But uh, I'm a realtor now as well. I needed to eat. I can't. I don't know what happened there. Um, I'm a realtor now. That's my backup plan. So I, I have a plan. I'm not going to continue. It's not, I'm not going to be grooming forever. Your body is physically not capable. I don't think so. At a certain point, you need to decide what your alternatives are because it's very physically tolling. Okay. I'm not going to be the groomer that can't, won't, impossible to do anything else because I didn't set myself up to do anything else. So that's why I got my real estate license and I do real estate and that's kind of where that's that's the next that's the next step for me is what I think if it's not teaching classes as a in a groom academy uh, it might that might that has been um, something that might pop up recently okay so I'm gonna go back and read some of this stuff you guys have been saying I kind of inspired you Saki I'm a wine reiner pitbull I'd love you to groom for but I live in New York New York that Wine Reiner and Pitbull Mix, unfortunately, it's not really hair cutting, but I will do that groom. You have to prepay, and it's uh, $350 per pet. Are you willing? Because I'm going to Japanese food, 7 is the best. I know! I know, Mikio. Extension cord is hilarious. That was hilarious. Okay, she did today spark. 
That one tip, brush every day, check with the comb, has helped my, my Havanese puppy so much. I'm so glad to hear that, Monique. Be, share that with people. Be like, hey, do you brush your dog every day? <laughs> we keep it short. I would keep the poodle short too. How often should I groom him? Two months in. Can you show me what kind of brush should I use? Please don't eat with your mouth full. It's rude. Well, I'm eating while I'm trying to stay here with you guys. So come back. Um, come back. Janet, come back later then because I'm not done with my sandwich. Um, what am I? Here's the bristle brush. The large bristle brush. I guess I should go get a new one for you. I sometimes uh, I feel like I'm just talking on video, but I'm actually live. This is a large bristle brush. I use it on every dog I groom. I don't have a small, a matter of fact, I sold my used small bristle brush already. So this is the large bristle brush. I use it on every dog, every dog, except for, you know, short hair dogs. They don't need that. They need the zoom groom, which is this one. Zoom groom for short hair breed dogs, okay? And sometimes if you guys don't know, if you don't like something, you don't like what I'm saying, push mute. If you don't wanna hear me talk, push mute. If you don't like what you're seeing, X, get on the X, like get out of there. Okay, so the next one is, let me go to your questions. I'm about to groom you guys, get ready. Janet said, it's rude, not a health hazard, so bye girl. Uh, viewers, what the fuck are you doing if your life? Something. I have a Maltese food. Haha. Ha, bye, Janet. Do you want her to choke on her food? Would you love to send a picture? Okay, you guys are being mean. Um, would love to send a picture of my Sabrina. Sh bring. Yeah, send it, man. You don't talk and eat. Blah, blah, blah. I'm a nail tech and need another thing to do with it so I can stay active. Is cat grooming a thing? It is, but have you groomed a cat before? Because it's really important that you know what you're doing with a cat. It's very dangerous. My briefings about cat grooming last about 20 minutes with the pet parent. Like, I am telling them how dangerous it is, and they need to, be, you know, figure it out. You are inspiration for me. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate ya. 90% of the time, I'm at the beach with the seniors. See, that's what I want, man. But you got to have income to pay. For. This is, it's... If you want to have a business, it's really expensive. Be prepared. She's nice enough to stay here with us. Yeah, that's my point. I was just trying to do that. She needed to eat, Janet, really. Thanks, Gretchen. I appreciate you. Okay, let's move on to... Is there anything you guys need to ask me before the groom comes in? Wow, we've been live for an hour. <sighs> Got to spend money to make money. Exactly. So be ready, man. If you're gonna open up a business, you better be ready. If you better not be already in debt, 20 grand, and then you're gonna open up a business, don't do that to yourself. If you've groomed a cat and a few others, make sure, like I have a, Allison has called me and, and asked for guidance on cat grooming, and I have helped her, but she do, does make me nervous because she groomed a cat that she said put, like, bit her hand like this, but didn't, she called it, didn't bite, but just mouthed her. So I said, oh my gosh, no, that's not okay. Mouthing only, mm -mm. no, no, no mouthing. Cats are not mouthing me, no, you know what I mean? So be careful, get a cat muzzle. I have these cat muzzles hanging here for a reason. Sometimes they even fit the tiny Shih Tzu faces. Get a cat muzzle. And even that is not, you know, gonna protect you 100%. So you gotta, oh, you gotta be careful. Please be careful. Thank you, mouthing leads to biting. If my dog was mouthing the groomer, I would go home and we would fix that. I would train that dog not to mouth, okay? I don't have any Jack Russell clients right now. Um, the last one I groomed, which is uh, Beth the Lab, Brown Lab, comes in for nail trim only, and mom, I, I have a video of mom holding her dog down, like that's how you do it. She had a Jack Russell, the Jack Russell attacked one of her girlfriend's dogs and she put her down and she was an older Jack Russell anyway started getting pretty grumpy so um cat muzzle I died laughing did you get a cat muzzle man but they are nothing is a hundred percent right Mikio you got it it's all start with the pet parents okay I find your videos really satisfying. Are you being satisfied now, Jenna, even though there's no dog on the table? <laughs> Slime says, help me. My dog does let her groom, so what can I do? My dog does let her groom. 
have to go back. I don't understand that one. The beach is like five seconds away from me. I love hanging out there. Wow, man, you guys are making me really jealous. Awesome. Yes, I do ship to Canada. Uh, you can build your order and check the pricing when you type in Canada on the website. When are you getting a client? Any minute now. Yeah. Are you waiting on the Oh, here we go. I'm handling some of this stuff here. Okay. So, let me check all this. I'm playing around with the screen here. <laughs> we are putting that. Oh, cool, man. <laughs> I put a user in timeout. <laughs> Why? Because she's like, you're not my mother and all this stuff. Because really? I'm eating here. I have to eat. I asked you guys, I asked everyone, we did majority vote. I was like, do you guys want me to eat and then, or do you want me to log off and come back? So, keep the live chat going. I mean, the just trim one yell at time until there. Yep, sounds good. Love your life, B. Appreciate it, man. All right. You got some slack now. Oh my gosh, you guys. He is really good here. Check this out. <laughs> Tracy goes, bye, Janet. She's in timeout, I guess. Okay, here we go. That's our core. <laughs> Dang it. What are you doing? You can't do that. It's charging. We're charging. <laughs> Sorry, that shit is hilarious to me, man. All right. <laughs> that is a it worked. That's hilarious. <laughs> we can. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're on a, char we're a charger. We're on a charger and an extension cord. <laughs> I've never gone live this long, you guys. I don't even know that it'll actually pow uh, power. I don't even know that it'll actually put on YouTube. Because YouTube does the thing. It's like, it's the live stream, and then it. it prepares itself and then it loads itself up and so i don't know how people load up the, the music i listen to sometimes i don't know how they load up the hours of okay um beam up scotty <laughs> beam me up have you done thought of grooming shelter i already did yep, i've done that a lot go to my website click on animal shelter grooming i mean it's it's there get buffered dd let me know when you're back tracy let me know if you're the cord of all cords. I know, right? You guys are hilarious. Uh, Georgia, if you want to know about my grooming, you have to go to my the YouTube channel. I think because the phone is being charging, it's buffering and lagging. Okay. So we're going to have issues there. I refreshed a couple times. How's it going now? Is it lagging? Let me see about the disconnection. Let me see. I disconnected the charge. We will ship to India, but it's not on our website yet. I, t I disconnected the charger. See if it were laggy still. It may catch up. Okay, give it some time. Let me move this. Let me move this. And then the extension cord is so long. You know how you lose. Okay, it's back. Okay, I can't help that. I don't know, man. What's our, let me look at we're at 41%. So if we get disconnected, we're not coming back today. So if we lose you again, because I unplugged it. So if we came back, it looks better. There it is. Everyone looks good. It's it's the charger. Dang, the charger's too long, man. Dang. Dang. I rigged this up for nothing. Do any paperwork today, man. You want to do, um... You can have the rest of my bread. It's too dry. I can't do anything now. Okay. Should be arriving any minute now. <laughs> I have long fingers. Okay. <laughs> 
keep charging it? No. Okay. What are you guys looking at? Anything? You're looking at that side, okay. I'm kind of cleaning and stuff. Kind of picky. Getting ready. I've once gone into some salons and stuff, man. Shih Tzu's coming in next. Uh, she doesn't get videoed very often, but she... Do you have the Christmas pictures on the website pulled up? Her, her, her owner has a... Oh, gosh, man. I'm just... I'm truly impressed by this female. Young woman. I'll ask Erin her age. A young woman in her 20-something, 20 21, 19... Do you know the Shih Tzu that we're grooming is should be on that website right there, right? The Christmas picture? Did I put hers on there? No. No, it's the pit bull. Remember the pit bull in the picnic basket? Um, do I have her picture somewhere else? Have to look. Super responsible uh, character and uh, honorable. I don't know everything about her. You only know so much about a client, about a person, but I'm gonna see if I have a picture on them. She's like, maybe, you guys wanna see some pictures? Um, here's Charlie. So I'm really close to Charlie's mom if you haven't figured that out. And it's Charlie for Christmas. Oh yeah, here. This is a cute one. This guy was a, they came in for pictures too. and. Yeah, they came in for pictures too. And they sent this to me for Christmas. I got everyone a package deal on Chris. Uh, I brought the unit here. This is a dog that just came in. The cockapoo. Did you guys watch the cockapoo just now? This is the other dog they own. They came in for all the pictures and stuff. I almost forgot. They actually, good people, military, prior military. This is me and, uh, me and Charlie. That was a good one, man. Uh, that came out great. Yeah, that was Lexi. That was Lexi. Look at her. She, they came out for pictures. Sent me this for Christmas, man. <laughs> Charlie. Look at Charlie, man. I just love Charlie. When I first met him, ear infection bad, real bad. And mom didn't know. I, I just took a... I did everything I could to help her. And we did. She was mad. He was mad. Into the, I, the, we go a long way back, you know. I'm actually looking for... The dog coming in now. They did a pit bull. She owns a pit bull and uh, the Shih Tzu. And the picture came out great. The pit bull sitting next to her. The Shih Tzu in the picnic basket. So cute, man. But yeah, uh, she is a real young woman and taking care of her brother. Her brother's like 11 now or something like that. I mean, just she took is taking care of that brother. And she works full time. I think she's still in school. I'm just like, I, I just, I think it's amazing. And she tips me. I mean, what? She is very responsible beyond her age. You know what I mean? All right, let me go back and look at what you guys are saying. I love you guys too, man. Is Charlie still angry at you for taking his girlfriends? Well, we got him a girlfriend. So Meadow stayed with, uh, I don't know if you saw the piece on Meadow for Facebook. We, t we picked up Meadow at that rescue situation with all those dogs and he fell in love with meadow and meadow and him are like inseparable so he has a buddy now charlie had a buddy sam sam was older than charlie sam passed away and sam has been alone since then so whenever i'd go take the girls over there for pet sitting charlie would really really connect and so now he has lexi full time or now he has meadow full time so it's pretty cool okay so vanessa's saying something here 
Please put the matted hair rug in a shower. Okay, so that was a far back. Okay, we kind of get forward here. Yeah, right? Some good clients, some not good clients or bad clients. It's not that. It's what some clients have brought Christmas gifts over the years. And uh, my regulars, you know, Cynthia, Jean, they always like spoil me. So it's, it's great to have people that love you, you know, whether they're clients or not. Like you guys, there's some of you YouTube people that love me and I adore you back. So take care of people that love you, you know. I love send a postcard to you or say hi or send you a small gift. Stuff like that's fun, right? My Westie had an ear and skin problems until I changed him to a raw diet. Exactly. Hopefully he's forgiving you for taking all his girlfriends. <laughs> right? Okay, so uh, with your personality, you're ma you'd make big bucks in Hollywood. Really? What are you trying to tell me, man? We were just talking about celebrity dog grooming the other day. <laughs> you have been nothing but a downer. Oh, really? You have been nothing but a downer. Oh, you're talking to Janet. My in-laws, Golden, has repeat ear infections. They won't do his ears. It makes me mad. Nothing you can do. <gasps> She's here. Okay. Can you take it? Nah, Janet can just... If, if she wants that kind of attention, great. Great for her. Janet, we don't have time for that. Um, sorry if you're not happy. We're going to move on. Um, okay. Hey, girlfriend, we're doing live feed. Do you want to say hi or anything? <laughs> Say hi real fast and I'll just look down. What's going on? Hey! So we're going to do um, live feed grooming or is that okay? Yeah. Great. It's fun. Yeah, That's she's all. about two months past due. Two months past due. Darn it. <laughs> nice nails. Thank you. All right. Look at your feet. Oh, my goodness, yeah, girl. Her face. Everything else just past couple weeks have been out of control. Oh, okay. Well, we'll get it all taken care of, won't we? Yes, we will. Look at you. You're so nervous. You're okay. You're okay. <laughs> Oh, honey. Right. It's okay. She's kind of nervous. She's kind of nervous. She gets worse every time we talk. Oh. <laughs> she gets more nervous. <laughs> Come on. Hi, girl. Come on. Do a full girl. I'll text you when we're done. Uh, she's so sweet, man. She's one of the sweetest. <sighs> one of the sweetest Shih Tzus out there. This is a pretty collar here, Lee Collar and Leash. It's very loose though. The moment they've all been waiting for. <laughs> yeah, thanks for waiting, you guys. You waited <laughs> 40 minutes. <laughs> Alright, this is it. <laughs> this is the last room for live today. Alright, here we go. But later on tonight, if you guys are happen to be on myfavoritegroomer.com, the chat icon, you're always welcome to try to chat with me. Make sure you do put an email address there because if you ch start a chat, it only it only names you by a number, okay? Janet, it's enough. Janet, Janet, it's enough, man. It is enough. It's enough. I'm starting to get pissed off. Pop your ass. She's angry because I blocked her. Gave her time out. An adult that misbehaves? Come on, people. Oh, take ownership. Just like, yeah, you know what? I was out of hand. All right, here we go. So, look how happy she is, man. She's so sweet. She's so sweet, man. Okay, here we go. She doesn't get a full groom all the time. Matter of fact, she does face feet sanitary a lot. That doesn't require bathing, but this time we need a full haircut and she usually kind of lets me do whatever I, I need to do. Uh, April 6th and today's August 1st. So April 6th, she was matted. So we did a seven all over. So she's grown out, which is fine. So let's just see. Her color is gorgeous, and so is her demeanor. Her demeanor is amazing. Try to see if I can just do a guard cut rather than this is all. You know what I mean? This has been. This is not matted, obviously. Look at her feet. <laughs> yeah, she's, she did this to 
sweet little thing. Sweet little thing. This is, needs to be cleaned up back there. Okay, let's just go. Let's do this. I'm going to start off with a sanitary cut. Okay, so you guys be ready. If uh, it's 31%, we might die. Here we go, Katie. If we die, we won't be back. So I just want to say thank you. I appreciate you all for watching. You guys make my whole day just a lot better. So I appreciate you being there. It's all matted in here. It's really important to get these uh, female sanitaries done well, man. You have to get that done, cleaned out really good. All right, be sure to share, shop with us if you can. You can do everything at myfavoritegroomer.com and myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop. And find us on Facebook and do all that good stuff. I have a feeling we're going to lose you here in about 20 minutes, but get all the mats out first. Is he for a now turn? Yes, okay, um, I'm going to meet you outside, is that okay? I'm working you in, so just bear with me for a minute. David, I'm going to switch you real fast, you're going to do her pads. So I did work that nail trim in, I, I've been on the phone, so I haven't been able to, so 40, 40 blade. I'm going to go fast because I'm actually doing live streaming and grooming, so sorry about that, but I can do it. You guys are going to watch me grow. <laughs> Kind of easy to make, so you don't want to dig too hard. Not yet, go ahead, you can keep going. It's gonna be this, okay. and then plus this. Okay, he's gonna come in, you're gonna catch him out. You wash my hands. She wants to lay down. Where's that? Okay, thank you. So we're doing, let's 
kind of like we picked up where we left off, right? So we got... She's like, hmm? What are you doing? You got the cookies or yeah. did you get cookies? Yeah, I got three of the three packs. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh look at her, she's so brave. <laughs> uh, the rates for the toenail trims increased a little bit, so I'll text you them so you'll know for next time. I'm not worried. Nice, right? Okay. Just so you know, I hate surprises like that. It's a, it's a text message or a okay. email. You could do it right there. Yeah, thank you. Is that fine? Is that yeah, oh yeah. Okay. Thank you. Guys. See you thank next you. Time. Bye. Bye. So I just did a walk-in nail trim. He had texted me earlier. Remember, if you guys were watching earlier, I was like, hey, I'll get that nail nail trim done. She t Her tail stopped because she got serious. She's like, okay, let me focus. Interesting how you can watch on certain dogs. Not very, they all don't act like this. <laughs> Okay, so I I don't really want to do a huge haircut here. I'm going to leave a lot on. We're going to do a haircut, but I'm not going to take off a lot like that. I'm just going to try my foreguard. You going to try your foreguard? You going to try the foreguard? This is fine, right? It's pretty thin, actually, too. I might have to do it. It's kind of choppy just coming like that. matted under there a little bit. Little tiny tangles. But they are so puffy. I just wonder why. Yeah, that's how you know when dogs are like, oh, my dog can't, won't stand still. Yeah, right, man. You just, if you have good training, a good dog, good breed, good genetics, there are really great dogs out there. Or trauma. Something happened to the dog where the dog's not going to do that anymore. You know, something, something or someone kept hurting the dog. Well, they don't act that way anymore. If I hurt her every time I groom her, it's not going to be nice in, in three or four years.
like left that. She's so sweet. She's wagging her tail the whole time. This red stuff here, that means she's chewing at that paw. Like, uh, the nails are too long. The pads are irritating. Something, she's chewing that paw for a reason. That's what that is. This whole paw, even underneath, actually. These are eight and a half, so they're long enough to go all the way around instead of like a lot of small, short, short scissoring. Big difference. That's really cool about your vet. Vet does that free stuff, really. And so you got to know your pets, too, because I know she has really big nipples back there. So I'm not going to scissor all that. I'm going to actually come back later. And it won't be perfect either because I'm not going to make it all, like, exactly perfect around every nipple. I'm not going to do that. Isn't she the best? Wow, she's, she's so amazing, man. She's chewing both her paws back here for some reason. I'm not trying for perfection here. We just want to get hair off that I know I'm not going to blow dry. So the blow dry is fast. We're going to come back over and do it all over again later. I'm going to show you some of these nipple, nipples. It's very important to pay attention to the body of the dog that you're working with. And I know her really well, so I feel confident, you know. Yep, I do. I sell them on my website under myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop. Here we go. You can go up for me? I'm going to show them your nipples. Come here. Can you see some of these nipples here? The lighting's really horrible. It's okay. You don't want to stand up? Okay. But she doesn't want to stand up. All right, so we'll go in here. I'm not going to make her stand up, but not every dog kind of has the same angle. See it? You see these? So if you're not, if you don't know the dog you're working with, it's really easy to take those babies off. Okay. Sydney, I sell the masks because I make them. Myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop and type in a uh, mask, face mask, or go, click on the face mask. You really want a good view. You don't want to accidentally hit something you shouldn't. So let's go up this way. And just skim here. But like, please tell me that's not a flea. Skim in between all the nipples. 
And you just want to be able to hike that leg like she's laying down on the floor. And again, I know because of her, I remember her nipples. <laughs> um, I'm not going to make it perfect down here. I just want to be able to get that hair off so she's as comfortable as she can. Okay? Be gentle. Be careful. A little bit on this side, and we're just about ready to go to the back. So if I dug really hard, then you would just grab a nipple it would just go straight shave off can you see them you guys you know what i'm talking about you feel me just skim man just get those out of there I like to come in with a pretty fresh blade on the face as far as uh, cool. Okay, the battery's running low. You better hurry up. We might not get the bath on this one. Just set your angle here. There you go. I wonder if you can plug in just a regular charger, just right over there. Put set the camera there and charge the just the regular one. You have 120. <laughs> Just get that out of your mouth. You might have some lag. We did put a charger in, but we're going to keep you guys uh, sitting at the same place. Okay, here we go. Huh? Looks good still. Looks good still, okay. So it was the extension cord. Maybe it was the extension cord. Okay. She's kind of not wanting me to get to the face, so that's fine. I like to leave all that, right? Every dog's different. I am going to trim this up though with the four bars. Kiss the dog. The guard lets you keep everything pretty even. So if you hand scissor and you're not really exactly even, you're going to have to keep fixing it over and over, right? So cute.
I don't want to go tension or something. See, I get sick from here. What the hell? People are crazy. Okay, stop. Go. Just ignore it. Just stop already. Yeah, I'm kind of done here. Kind of done, yeah. We'll leave the face nice and cute like that. It's like a freaking cyber type. Man. It's like a group of Facebook people on a group of. Uh, what happened so so like? Because she went and complained somewhere. And then they left, like all. And they quick. went, hurried up and out of their busy lives to come uh, troll. It says a lot about their character, you know. It says a lot about how people act when they're not in front of you. It's almost like. Can't say it out loud. Ah, oh, she's so beautiful, man. Thanks, Angie. It's funny, like, um, these people are real people that, do we care? Nope, I don't care. Does she care? Nope, we don't care. We're doing, or whatever I'm doing right now, God is proud of me, not doing what you guys are doing. So, we go to bath? Yeah, I me. Mean, we're gonna go to the bath. See, what am I doing and what are you doing? It's a big difference. Big difference, man. You gonna do the bath? I'm gonna do it quickly and then you can talk some more. Yeah, 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 sounds good. Okay. We're gonna do this, uh, well actually I don't have to hurry, but we're, we're ready to go. As far as, I gotta wrap stuff up. So he's gonna do a quick bath. That was crazy though. It was crazy, they're still there. Uh, they're still there. Really? We got 300 views on you guys because of the trolls? <laughs> that was back down. It's just crazy, it's like whoa.
This is why I exist. I am serious, man. I am so serious right now. Oh, something else. So I can tell you right now, if 150 people can log on to our live stream and bash, bash like that, I know you guys can help me get to 100,000 subscribers. I know that the people that love me should do double. Okay, so here we go. So, my Lord Jesus Christ is here and he protects me and he surrounds me and he surrounds those that care about me. He surrounds the dogs that are in need and the people that are in need. And without God, we would not be here. We would not be doing the things that we do. And we would not be helping so many people. So, it is. It's still actually, they're still there. They're still um, doing their thing. They're blessing us with their presence. I do know my true viewers. And uh, those people that are not, I, they don't scare me. They don't scare me. And actually, everything that they're doing is on live feed. So, lawyer, have at it, right? So God be with us. God be with those people, those haters and those trolls. And please help to fix their lives and, be, and have mercy upon their attitudes and what they do to others. I had one person that pissed off, got pissed off because she told me I was eating and shut up and blah, blah, blah. So I blocked her and she got pissed. So that's what happens. Okay. I think if a child, a cute little child can walk around and go, hey, why are you ugly? Or hey, uh, I want some of that ice cream. That if, if a child is so cute doing that, we should be adults and we should be just as cute when we say, hey, stop being an asshole. Hey, be nice. Hey, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's not an emotion. It is a word. So if you don't like that I was eating my sandwich, I told her to push mute. I told her to remove herself. And that, that's not harmful. It wasn't hateful. It wasn't nothing. So, Okay, so this is what I do when I feel really offended and hurt. This is, who I, this is what I call on. Okay? Do this. That's why I have him everywhere. He's within everywhere. I don't know who blocked who, but I know David was handling some stuff. I was grooming, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I know you guys are going to be there for me. Okay, so we're back at 151 now, and we've got, I know some of you guys were asking. I'm going to hold this here so that you guys, uh, you haters watching me still, you know that you are not a part of this this group because this is this is here. This is in front of me, protecting me. Anyway, um, Bella. Lassa. Actually, I had it all wrong. What? Okay, so she looks completely like a Shih Tzu, doesn't she? But I have in my notes, she's a Lassa Opso. And at the time she began coming here, she was two years old. And uh, she had just moved here, and that's how she found me. She found me from uh, the reviews of my grooming, okay? And she has been here ever since. And I uh, thank you. Thank you, Jeanette. So you guys can see that, right? Can you imagine that those are people that should be, those are other groomers? I would never do that to another groomer. I, w I have called groomers in my area that were really sick and handicapped and offered them help. I would want to help another groomer. I would not want to do that to people in my industry. If someone needs help, I'm like, hey, you want to know? I, I mean, you want to take hours of help. You, you got to charge, okay? That's, you don't get free training. That's different. But if you were just in my industry and you needed help, Dude, I would be helping you, man. I wouldn't bash you. And if there was something I didn't like, like I didn't like the way you smoked or I didn't like the way you smelled, I would just not hang out with you, you know? Okay, so let's go with, uh, let's go back and look at some of the, anyone having questions that are real? These other people, I don't know. Girl, uh, yep, exactly. Wow, Brian says only low IQ morons believe in God. Wow so hateful you are such a long day when else do you I don't even that needs some that's got some misspelling um, doo -doo -doo. People, are assholes. people are assholes <laughs> yes there are they are out there they exist oh they're still there <laughs> yeah I know right hard to read comments through this troll raid so Mikio let me know what you think what I need to do do you want me to log off and log back on just keep it like that, David. So just keep it like that. We're almost done with our groom here. When you guys block them, can you can you guys block them and off the channel or off the feed? Them. I was blocking them all, right? On 
David said he was blocking them all too. So when you block on you, when you guys are watching you, you can actually block, right? I guess you can block somebody. So. Okay. Okay. Yeah, actually, this is this is handmade by Kent. He this is this is in my store. Um, I have a lot of his handmade work here. He he actually I support our locals. So make it yourself kind of folks and he just look at this beautiful cross isn't this beautiful he handmade this if you want one please let me know Sh Yvonne's like I just get I just got here good you missed the shit all that late. just went down all late, all late. <laughs> Save, David's bathing our dog and uh I'm gonna double check man she looks so much like a shih tzu doesn't she but I could see where it could be, you know, she's got it. So a Lhasa, and a Lhasa Apso and a Pitbull mix is what she has. Man. Tina, send me your channel. I'll go check it out. We love you too. You can hide completely. Thanks for blocking them, you jerks. Um, I'm re please report people. Hateful, hateful. I wish more could happen. Um, the lawyer side and the law has not uh, gotten here fast enough to protect us. Precious blood of Jesus cover us all. Amen to that. Okay, so da da da. Thank you, man. I love my attitude too. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, let me go. Oh, I see what I see how to do this. Let me see what happens here. <laughs> Oh, okay, darn. I, I messed up on that one. I'm kind of playing around with it. Okay, so I'm waiting for our finish. We're almost done. Ah. Thanks, Mikio. I got that. Um, I can't read your name because it looks like it's in um, Indian. But thank you. Thank you for saying that about it. Really? Trolls could be teenagers. Yeah. And it is. Is it still summer where you guys are at? God exists because golden retrievers exist too. Do I know you? Did you send me something on golden retrieverish? You want a cross for your mom? This cross runs seventy-five dollars. It's handmade. I will send you my cross and have a new one made for me, just to make sure you know there is one to sell. So if you're interested, please do email me dd underscore grooms at yahoo.com. I will I will get you one made by Kent. And. I'm trying to, I can't go far because we're, we're charging, remember? Darn it. It's the filter feeders. They get offended by people who have to eat real food. <laughs> it is beautiful woodwork. It is gorgeous. It, this has got a thing on the bottom, but yeah, Kit Corbett 2012. I've had it for a long time. Isn't it beautiful? It's so beautiful. Protect me. Guys, I always put it right on my heart, man. I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for God. Okay, I'm keep going. Have we seen the pit bull? No, the, she doesn't bring her pit bull in. They came in for photos, and that was it. Woo, we're already done. Okay. Um, you are such a this and that. You can go block some more, sweetie, but okay. I don't have time for this. We need a gig work. Yes, we do. There's too much happiness here. So, see you later. See you later, Hada. Okay. Yes, Miss Sophia. Did you have a good bath? Yeah. Did you have a good bath? Oh, just love you. Just love you. Just love you. You're such a good girl. You're such a good girl. Yes, you're such a good girl. <clears throat> Whoops. You're such a good girl. Yes, you are. What are you doing, huh? What are you doing? All right, here we go. I'm gonna do a little leave-in conditioner here. The effects will be later. A remix video. I was accidentally zooming in, babe. You were zooming in? On accident, yeah. Could you zoom in? Yeah, but it's really hard. It kind of like zooms in a lot. Like, are you doing a remix video, David? <laughs> <laughs> this 
spent hours with you guys, man. That's pretty cool. I feel like I had a bunch of friends. <laughs> when usually it's like nice and quiet, right? Real lightly, you let the brush do the work. You don't have to dig too hard. That's how you brush burn a dog. You're digging too hard. I'm actually very, just letting the, the teeth grab itself. You don't have to dig. The hair is pretty thin, which is why he got done and bathing and drying in like six, eight minutes. Making sure there's my like dead skin there, kind of make sure nothing's going on. Take a good look. Sorry, you guys, you guys are on a charger, you know. Wow, someone gave me 20 bucks? What? You're amazing, really? Thanks, man. <laughs> That's so sweet. They said, God bless you, Dee Dee and David. Thank you for sharing your knowledge and positive, positivity. Oh, you're going to make me cry, man. Thank, thank you. I'm seriously tearing up over here. It's so sweet. People are so mean and people are so, so kind at the same time. Gailey Bunny says, hey, we want lumpia. She has fresh fried lumpia. What? How do you know I like lumpia? Like what? Did you read my mind? Where are you at? I'll pay for the FedEx. I'm not joking. Next day or what? I don't know. Next day. Lumpia, you can freeze and then put some uh, ice packs in there. Probably would be okay for a three-day travel. We went to uh, Hawaii recently uh, for delivering supplies to Hawaii back in, not recently, a few months ago, three, four months ago. And... March, April, runner. Yeah, March, April or something. We delivered supplies out to uh, over 16 different groomers. And all I did was go around looking for lumpia. <laughs> yeah. I'm serious. Oh, Makio has lots of lumpia. I know, man. We went to one restaurant here for lumpia, and I was like, I was so just, I was just so unhappy. You miss Jax? You got to go back. There was three videos, right? Okay. Camera's all in my way. I'm all thrown off. No, I mean, like, the camera's there, but I, I've got, I'm not thinking.
just wagged your tail the whole time, you guys. Oh yeah, she's looking so cute. Isn't she? She's looking so cute. You're looking so cute. Yes, you are.
What do you guys see in here? Got that? Let me see. Don't you love, I, I love how quiet it is. Do you love that? Like imagine the dog just being chill, you know, they can relax. It's just really quiet where I grew here. That's the best part of like making appointments for grooming. You know, you can't change the walk-ins if you have walk-ins and you got, you know, someone needs to talk to that person, but creating a very much an appointment groom system it doesn't make the most money a groom shop can make, but it does make the grooms absolutely different. Absolutely different, man. All right, so let's kind of look at everything as a whole here. How far I can get this piece of work to move, but let me see here. Yeah, not far at all, you guys. We still got a uh, charge? Sorta. It's not re reacting to that. Let me see here. It's not charging. It's not charging. Oh, it might be the wrong um, charger. It's keeping it alive, but it's not charging. It doesn't even look like it's plugged in, though. No, but it doesn't even look like it's actually plugged in itself. You guys still there? Yeah. You're not blocking enough people, man. Vanessa, thank you. Okay, here we go. So we're about to wrap it up. Okay. 
Okay, thanks, thank you. I needed to see you guys were still here. <laughs> Did she? I'm gonna try to try to move the camera around for you guys. That's the groom loop, Dee Dee. Don't brush the groom loop. Really? <laughs> yeah, she's looking great. Okay, we're good to go, man. Do some conditioner. Oh, I always say that. We'll do some leave-in. Leave-in. Some pet soap, rainforest. I love it. All done. We're all done, man. Can you look this way, baby? We made it. They got to see the full groom. Huh? Well, I've got to text mom and let her know, you know, uh, but I am actually curious to myself. I'm like, lassos are usually bigger. I had a, the only dog that ever bit me as a child was a lassa apsa. My aunt was raising them and breeding them at the time. So lassos are usually bigger and mean. Um, they get pretty impatient and mean. So, hey, what are you doing? Look at your pretty face. Now. Whoop, whoop. Thank you all for hanging in there. I mean, some of you have been on live with me for three hours. Whoa. Isn't that crazy? You guys are awesome, man. Look how amazing she is. You're amazing. You're an amazing, girl. Thank you. Bella. Bella. We told mom you're ready to go. Are you ready to go? Are you ready to go? Come here. Come here. Then we'll put this on you, okay? Yeah. Look at what are you doing. What are you doing? Look at your cute little face. You're such a good dog. You're such a good dog. Yeah. Yeah, you're such a good dog. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're such a good dog. Oh, I wish you guys would be closer. Uh, I would muzzle your chihuahua in the bath, or I would also try to introduce water in a bathtub kind of form, like in a bucket. I have a bucket of clean water and a bucket of uh, dirt, you know, your rinse water, that kind of thing. You know what I mean? Let me see if I can kind of manage this right here. I don't know what this is doing here. Yeah, I definitely try to do this again. Um, let me do put Bella here closer. Hi, say hey, babies. Say hey. Say hey. Oh, you did so good. She stood up the whole time. She was precious and sweet. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that what you want in a groom dog? What's on her neck? Her collar? A so little cool. flower? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, this came with the collar, it looks like. It's really pretty. It's kind of felty and rubbery. It's really pretty. Pretty little rose here. Okay. Romania, that's so cool. She's the last one we're going to do live today. Uh, David has class here. He starts in a little while. We might hit the gym for a minute. I'm not sure. But we definitely want to get a true lunch on the way to class. Fresh pine sap out of paws. Try goo gone. Try that. Try goo gone. Goo gone the natural, you know, the all natural stuff like that. Goo gone. Uh, try that first. 
Sometimes just soap, uh, intense soap. You know that soap you use as an auto mechanic? Try that first. Those are like, a, I would love you to order from me, but those would be the first things you can go get locally. How long have you groomed? 15 years. With your help, I learned to groom my Yorkie. Woohoo! awesome. This dog is like three. Or we just did her file. And her file, I have, you know, I don't look at the file every time in that, in that sense. So I always, in my mind, thought to myself, Shih Tzu, but I looked at the file after two years just now in the sense of not the haircut, right? So I always read the haircut, but I looked at the file and I was like, it says lasso. So I was like, oh gosh, I got, I have to ask, make sure. But yeah, I usually write down because I sit down and do a 10 minute check-in. So I write down the pet breed from the pet parent. So it is what it is. <laughs> Did you already text her total and everything? Tell her to head this way? Oh, babe, that's a pit bull. This is a pit bull, he said. <laughs> Their pit bull is so cute looking. I have to find a picture. Tear stains, shave them out and wash the face daily. Do not use chemicals to try to get rid of the tear stains. It doesn't work. It's not a long... Just, just wash the face with a towel. I actually sell some really great, cute uh, towels, face towels for dogs. They could be for humans too, but dogs. The lasso app, so. Could He's, be, right? A little bit? Mix, maybe? Little gosh, bit. it's so close. I do see that he's pulled up a lasso just to kind of compare it. I do see the it. Color. I do see the resemblance. The new Fondland question is such a large question. Um, I have to pass on that one. Pollen, dog pollen and allergies. I know you have pet silk tea tree shampoo, but the last shampoo I used with tea tree dried his skin out. Yeah, well, I can't say that about our pet tea tree. Um, tea tree shouldn't do that. So it makes me wonder what is, what is it that you used? Just ate a baked potato. Mmm. Was there bacon and cheese and sour cream on it? <laughs> Mikio, you are hilarious. 17-year-old bladder. <laughs> what? How'd you get into grooming? I got it. That's such a long... Let me make sure that little questions aren't answered. Make sure to leave a DD, DD a like for her videos, guys. Oh, thanks, Vanessa. What does that like do, though? What does it do for us? She is tied to a groom loop, so she doesn't get off the table. Um, if you don't do that, then a dog jumps and hits its head on the concrete. We'll have a fractured skull, possibly, and we don't want that. This is safety in our industry. Some people may not understand it. Um, you gotta have something holding the dog on the table, unfortunately. And, and correcting the head at the same time. It's like a leash. Wolf, is it matted? I don't understand. Hey, Vicky from Memphis, what's up? Been on two hours strong. Sydney, thank you for your time and all you other folks that are watching. Thank you so much. I don't even think I'm that interesting, but if you're happy, I'm happy. <laughs> Senior pits, really? I don't know. I have very many senior pit bulls. Hmm. Hand stripping. I wish I knew how to hand strip, but you have got to start hand stripping really early on. I mean, like born. Uh, if you, I knew a Karen Terrier breeder, and she hand stripped all of her pets. Matter of fact, I would send any hand hand stripping clients that were interested. Dotsons, you know. Westies, Dotsons, Scottish Terriers. All these dogs should be hand stripped. But if you're not hand stripping, Hand stripping, I might have a hand stripper back here. No. It's like a flat tool and it's got a little knife on it. And you just basically pluck all the hair out of the coat. And what doesn't get plucked stays, that's the haircut. That's a, that's it's, that's a hand stripping job. So it is, yeah, it takes two to three hours to do on each pet. And it should cost a lot of money. It's a long time. And you're doing this the whole time. You're plucking all the hairs out, basically. That's what hand stripping is. So I, I never learned how to hand strip. And if I did, I probably wouldn't be doing it now. It's, it would be a lot of work on your hand. Like, imagine just doing this for hours, three hours straight. That's a lot of hand work. Um, if you're in breeding and you're in showing and things like that, then you can easily say, yes, uh, you would hand strip certain breeds, but you really, really should start off a very young dogs doing that. You don't want to take a 10 year old Scotty and start hand stripping it in my opinion. Okay. Oh, your Hannah, your dogs watched it with you. That's so great, man. Yeah. I went a little shorter to kind of do, uh, show my ears and it just, I wanted a style, you know, I've done all these short, short man haircuts over the years. 
And I was like, wow, it's becoming, I had all those ponytails in my head. Don't think I didn't notice. I was like, dude, I'm like 40 something years old with ponytails. You gotta be kidding me. I was like, this has got to stop. Baby wash claws are perfect for that, for facial washes on dogs. Boxers are definitely hard to breathe. Um, and they usually don't have a lifespan above 10. There, uh, usually there are, but it's really hard. So uh, your Havanese puppy is 12 weeks old. Start the grooming ASAP. Gidget, the surf pug, is white. Ask her mom, Alexia, what she used to clean her tear stains. A good breeder starts the puppy from four weeks on hand stripping or grooming. I use tea tree oil on my cat's ears when her allergies act up and it doesn't make them dry. Oh, like tea tree oil like on the ears, the thinness of the ear? You don't want crusty ears, okay, or nose. Loss of face has longer stop. She may have shih tzu in her and is more prominent. Maybe her litter mates mo look more like a lhasa. Yeah, it's very short here. Very, like, very short. Almost looks like um, Jackson. Almost like her face looks like Jackson. Remember Jackson? The wild, my real estate, one of my real estate bosses' dog, Jackson. He's kind of wild, but he's been doing pretty good lately. Girl, you're almost 60? What? Man, you got a lot of life in you, girl. In your live streams, it can bring your stream up the trending list, making you easier to find. Ooh, that's good to know. How'd you know that, Vanessa? Get Gailey, I had lumpia and rice with sweet and sour sauce. Why are you making me so hungry? Sorry, I just came. Is the groom completed? Absolutely, the groom is completed. Are you over here looking at my... I can't move the camera. Bella. Hey. Hey, Bella. Hey, Bella. We're answering questions while we wait for your mommy. You wanna, you okay? See, she stood up the whole time, look. All dogs are not lazy, man. Oh my God, Gailey, I'm jealous. Yeah! <laughs> I'm jealous on that lumpia. I love, I love authentic foods. I love authentic music. Um, I love different cultures of music and food. David will get in the truck sometimes and I'm listening to Indian music and he's like, what is going on? best okay so my favorite groomer.com slash shop a lot of you know this already I've repeated myself but again I'm repeating myself because there's repeat questions go to brushes and the large slicker brush the large slicker brush is what I use all day long on brushing hair except for short hair breeds that need the zoom groom so the large slicker brush and you always want to check with a comb if you can't go through the hair it's snagging yeah, I can scare you if it's snagging, then you didn't brush good enough. So make sure you, you buy the combo. C brush and comb. Okay, you guys, I'm going to check down. I'm about to say goodbye. And the phone is really hot. Wow, Savannah, you're so late. We're about to leave. Bigger or dog, bigger or small. No, there's a large dog that's it just, it, it doesn't, It's there's no percentage. Um, each dog is different. I would say a more active dog stands up more, right? Flea allergies. Uh, you have to kick the fleas or the flea allergies won't ever go away. Go to myfavoritegroomer.com on the right hand. Gailey, you're Filipina, so I know how to cook the... Hello, no wonder. Should you give your German Shepherd a haircut? It just depends. Is it matted? How much of the ear stuff for my dog? How much for the ear stuff for my dog? There's an ear cleaning kit. That's what I recommend. But the ear cleaning kit will be designed for dogs that have ear ear hair because it comes with the hemostat and the hemostat plucking pad things like that so if you don't need that then you should just get the ear cleaner and the malacetic otic which will probably be about 40 something bucks plus shipping and handling so you got to answer her you i would say name your dog how you want that dog to act and i would kind of do some case studies which which is um go to myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop go to health and then look at all the ear stuff i have Goodbye, when will you be live again? I'm not sure, Tracy. Um, they're hit or miss these days, but I will try to be live more. Now that I'm finding out, it might push us up uh, where we can be seen more. I would totally do that. York Peppermint Patty, you can call her Patty. Mm -hmm. Yorkie, Yorkshire, that's so cool. Seten, Seten. In a Canada, she's a Shih Tzu and Poodle. How long do you think mom will take, huh? How long do you think mom gonna pick you, pick you up? Hmm? Well, I'm just going to take you out. <laughs> She's so sweet, man. She's so sweet. 
Should owners cut their own dog's nails? Not if you're gonna hit the vein. You gotta take some training. Uh, no, I groom a lot of Bichons. We just groomed a Bichon the other day. Uh, we didn't do it on video though. Uh, several Bichons. He's the only matted Bichon that comes in like that, but we haven't seen him for a few months now. What's up, Australia? How's it going? <laughs> Hit the subscribe button and the bell. Next time Dee Dee is live, you'll get a notification. Thanks, Dat Cat. I appreciate that. That's so true. Yeah, you can file nails instead of doing them at home, but if you've got a nail, you guys want to see some nails? Where's David? I'm gonna show you some nails, man. Ah, come here for a second. I'm ready to go, man, I'm tired. You tired? I'm so tired, man. Nah. Well, I'm good here. I've got myself situated pretty good. Okay, so here's some information. Yeah, I went out of focus because I left the screen and stuff. I don't have any pets, but I still watch this religiously. Thanks, Veronica. No, no more clients today. I have uh, paperwork to do now. And it has acrylics. <laughs> Short coat to medium hair cats with dense coat. This is your cat brush. It's a cat zoom groom. Get it on our website, myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop. Taryn, how, how can you miss the whole thing? It's so unfair, right? Yeah, thanks a lot. 70,000 subscribers. We need to get to 100. So you guys that just got here, be sure to subscribe. Subscribe and make sure you share, share, share. If we can have all those haters bring in 150 within a few minutes, y'all that love me should be able to bring in 150. In seconds, in seconds he said. We had 150, we had 300 viewers for seconds bashing. So if that can happen, y'all love me, share. That helps us grow, man. No one picked up kittens. Can you guys believe that? Nobody picked up any kittens. I did have a wonderful woman uh, with the blind chihuahua, remember her? She came and dropped off cat food and then I matched her and I dropped off the cat food for us. Yeah, nobody picked up any kittens. Those kittens have multiplied. And those kittens in a month and a half have turned into triple. Did you hear me? They're not kittens anymore. Two months now, they're not kittens anymore. It's not my duty now. You know what I mean? Like I the the um, that's a groom, mobile groom client of mine that I was trying to help. So I put it on my Facebook. I put it on a YouTube video. I shared it. She didn't want me to call the shelter at all. Okay. The SNP clinic would have done free snipping if we caught them and brought them in in cages. And she doesn't have, I don't have any kennels either. And she doesn't have any kennels. So by the time, and so I'm grooming, you know, I'm working, I'm working and still doing, helping Cynthia, helping, you know, I'm it's still functioning. So I put it out on her, in her world to, I, she doesn't work. She's stay at home. Uh, this is Bella. Yeah, so two months in, the kittens have tripled. And I went to groom her Yorkie, which I gave her the warning. I told her, if you don't do something, they will, they will multiply. And not only will they multiply. Wow, some creators just shut down. That's so sad. So not only do they multiply, they keep multiplying. And they leave the yard at night. You know what I mean? When people are, when you're sleeping. Because, okay, th what I'm talking about is, they so I lost a lot of people here. What I'm talking about is a lot of, uh, my, my personal mobile groom client, I get there. She has all these kittens in her backyard. She said, Dee Dee, I don't know what to do. And I said, I, she, and I said, are you feeding them? Once you start feeding kittens, it's oh, kit, cats and kittens. She had three mothers with kittens, uh, okay? So I told her, don't, I said, you need to do something. I said, right now, call the city animal shelter that you live in. And she goes, no, no, Dee Dee, I don't want to do that. And I said, if you don't do that, it's going to affect you. So I did the YouTube video. I put it on Facebook. And then when I came back and I kept checking on her, it got to a point where she was almost making, like, I was like, hey, I'm trying to help. I can't take over, right? Because I, I am doing thousands of things. Whereas you're a stay at home mom now or grandma, stay at home grandma. Okay. And I'm like, I need you to 
call. I gave her numbers to call. I gave her shelters to call. I gave her uh, rescue groups to call. And I'm going to do my part, right? Share it on Facebook, Call my, tell my clients, put a flyer up, stuff like that. I did try. Comes back, man, the, the cats have tri tripled. And when I went to groom her dog, it was infested with fleas and ticks. And I told her, look, I don't pull ticks off because if it gets infected, you would blame me, right? Oh my goodness. She had over four ticks on her Yorkie. And then she has a grandson running around there. And I was like, you're infested with fleas and ticks now. Look, what are we gonna do? It's like, you need to call now. She's, they tripled. The, the cats, kittens tripled, man. Oh, okay. Uh, mom, your baby did great. She, mom's here for pickup. Okay, remind me, because I haven't asked you this in a very long time. Is she Lhasa Apso? Yes. Uh, Full-blooded? As far as I know, yes. I got her from my uncle. She's originally from Indiana. From Indiana. So she got Bella from her uncle from Indiana, and uh, as far as she knows, she's full blood Lhasa. Here, I'm over here like, I'm bringing a Shih Tzu in for grooming right now. <laughs> I'm so sorry. She's Lhasa Apso, you guys. So even how we talked about the short n n nose here, She's a Lhasa Apso, okay? So pet parent is confirming for us. All right, I'm gonna chit chat for just a minute after we get checked out here. But uh, Bella's hanging out with me. She's been on live feed. You can check out the live feed later, mom. Oh, I don't want to so bad. I you do? About, I thought about doing it uh, while I was out running around, but I was like, oh, all right, you guys. I can't move you guys because the phone died, you know? 17%, at least it's charging. I'll be right back. Say bye, you guys. Say bye, see you later, see you later. So sweet. She's such a sweet dog. You have the best dog in the world, girl. So I didn't do a seven shave down or anything. Is this cute? Yeah? Just adore you all. Thank you so much. Yay. She was so happy the whole group, man. She wags her tits. She does that the whole room. Unless she's like, I was doing her nails. She's like, <laughs> yeah. Every time I try to mess with her feet, she's like, yeah. <laughs> she looks so good. You look so good. Yes, you do. You look so good. Yes, you do. I just adore y'all. Thank oh, you so much for coming in. I appreciate it. Okay, see, hopefully, I'll come back sooner. I will wait as long Bye. as you're another Bye. haircut. Bye. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and now, no problem. She wasn't truly mad or anything tangled, but. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. Really? 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 Okay, we're out of here. We're so out of here, you guys. Let me see if the door. You got it plugged in again? Yay! Woo, woo, woo. Isn't she sweet? All right, you guys. I love you, and thanks for whooping those freaking whooping them, man. You guys were whooping them while I was working. I kind of, I was like, what is, I could barely pay attention. I was like, what is going on? I was like, what's all that? Kiss her, kiss her, kiss her. All I saw was kiss, and then I had to keep working, you know? So, just make sure you take care of people you love and uh, support people you love. And for those of you who donated some money, I didn't even ask. I appreciate you. It goes a long way. Helps me keep doing what I do for others. Like the kittens. I can't believe they tripled, man. I mean, I was like, oh my gosh, you need to do something now. I said, it's now affecting your home. You're inside your home and your dog and your grandson could get bit by these fleas. I mean, you got to change it now. I said, you got to do something now. So, phew. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you. 70,000. Whoop, whoop. Those of you guys who just uh, arrived, hopefully this will load up later on YouTube. You can watch it from the beginning because you missed Jax, man. Jax's groom was great. You also missed a, a Be Lexi's groom and Bella's groom. I mean, you really missed it, man. <laughs> it was just a random live. I haven't gone live in a while. And I was like, I'm going to go live. And it lasted for hours. So those of you who hung out the whole time with me, thank you so much. And please shop with us, share, help us get to 100,000. We are looking for, I'm, I'm at 1 million already, but David said, take it in stride. So 100,000. So we want to get there in the next couple months, if, if possible. And uh, thank you, God, for the strength and support. <sighs> Game of Thrones? We're done with Game of Thrones. How late are you? I mean, are, are they, did they load the next season yet? You're still stuck on Game of Thrones, man. Mm, that's such a great one. That's such a great one. Love you guys. Bye. See you later. Peace out. I'm like, I'm steadily not going anywhere. <laughs> See you later.
I have not time for TV. Girl, I have not time for TV. <laughs> we binged watch that during uh, Thanksgiving last year, man. See you later. Amy's like, no, I just got here. No. <laughs> Peace. Peace out. Peace. I really adore you all. Peace out. Peace out. See you later. <laughs> well, what am I supposed to do? Push the button now? <laughs> It was fun, wasn't it? It was super fun. It was super fun. I love you too, man. See you later. Bye. You guys are the best. Ooh, ooh. I know, Yvonne finally arrived. Oh, maybe was, I got the wrong Yvonne. Sorry, Yvonne, sorry about that. It was the wrong Yvonne. Wrong California Yvonne. I was like, ain't no lie, baby, baby. <laughs> All right, so um, letting you all say your goodbyes and stuff. All right, we got to get out of here. We got things to do. See you later, and uh, please comment on the videos. Share, 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 and we'll see you later. Bye.